All right, so my first question for you is actually, could you tell me a little bit about your character in the film and what did you kind of learn from portraying her? Um, yeah, so my character in Palma is um, a young woman called Shelley, who is uh, the mother of um, Sam, um, the lead boy in the film played by the extraordinary um, young writer, who is, um, a truly beautiful soul and um, yeah, someone I, I feel very grateful to play the mother of. Um, but she is uh, battling with drug addiction. She is also um, still a child and not prepared with the tools to be a mother yet. But she has this extraordinary little boy who um, is growing and, you know, needs to keep growing and she's kind of trapped in a moment in time and um and that ends up being a, a complicated journey for the two of them that ultimately leads to her having to sort of set him free um and what did I learn I learned a lot from playing her I learned uh you know I'm, I'm not a mother yet but I got a little insight into what it it might be like um and I learned a lot from my my co-stars from both Justin and Ryder. I loved watching them work and I loved doing the scenes with them. And um, I learned, uh, I, I did quite a lot of research on crystal meth. I learned some devastating facts about that drug and how it destroys people from the inside out, um, but how highly addictive it is. And um, I don't know, yeah, I empathize so much with, with Shelley and, um, uh, yeah, I had um, a wonderful experience on that job that was also, you know, sometimes heartbreaking. Yeah, absolutely. And with viewers seeing the various battles that Shelley will go through in the film, what advice would you give to someone who might be watching this, who might be struggling with addiction or even loving someone with addiction? Um, well, I would definitely say you can't save anyone. You can only love them. Um, I believe that to be true. Um, people, uh, yeah, need to be loved so they can save themselves, I think. Um, but I do think that uh, my advice would also be, you know, don't give up. I think uh, people can be very quick to kind of, you know, brush drug addiction to the side and, and uh if somebody's battling with drug addiction, it doesn't mean that they're not um, a fully formed, loving, intelligent, emotional human. In fact, it's, you know, they probably feel those things very, very, very intensely and need help handling it. But um, I think, you know, if somebody has an honest heart and an open heart, doesn't matter what they're going through. If they really pay attention to what's going on right in front of them, they'll do the right thing. And what was it like for you to be able to work with Justin Timberlake and the rest of this cast? Oh man, it's just wonderful. Honestly, I, I'm, I'm so grateful for every second of it. I think Justin is an extraordinary actor. He's so giving, he's so acutely aware of of every moment and breathing life into it. And he's so, he cares so much about the characters he's playing. And then Ryder, I think is just an extraordinary revelation. I can't believe that this was his first job, you know? And I, I feel so proud to have witnessed that and been a, um, a part of it because I think his performance is so um, powerful. And I think the two of them together, their relationship is really inspiring. And the film is really about second chances. Do you believe that people deserve second chances in life? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, well, I have, yeah, I, do, I sincerely do, as long as people do it honestly. And my final question for you is, what's something you want people to know while watching this film? Um, I mean, I hope that, I hope that they finish the film and feel inspired to exist in their, their, their themselves, you know, and, and to enjoy that and to also really not judge people around you and instead actually listen, learn and love and try and understand people because we all want to be understood, you know.